The environment here is just really phenomenal. You know, Mike alone is one thing, but his family was there. This is a family owned and operated business. The minute we drove up, his mom and dad were there. They were uh, very engaged in our success as well. I'm with Mike Gardner, Hoss Hog Hunting Adventures. Starting the day off right, it's gonna be a good morning. Day one, get fired up. I could see that he was getting excited and, and I feed off that and it gets me real excited about taking a professional hunter out here and uh, really challenging myself as a guide and him. You know, you just don't know what to expect until you get up here. Now, let me tell you a little bit about the rams. They are so skittish, they are so difficult to hunt, we couldn't even get on them. They spotted you 200, 300 yards away and you just couldn't put a stock on them. That was awesome. But the pigs, let's talk about the pigs. Pigs were everywhere. We saw groups of seven, 12, 15, 30, every morning and every night for three days solid. We saw the biggest pig I could ever imagine seeing. We got set up, the thing was nestling through the brush. Man, my drill was going so crazy. Drew my bow back and I was so worked up. I shot right over this boar. He must have been 350 pounds. To see his reaction, to see the passion he had, I know what this ranch has, but it's hunting and you can't always script it. The stock was on and we just didn't close the deal. He shot a little high and that boar ran off and his heart dropped, his head dropped and, and you could just uh, see right then that it was about the hunt. It was a real pleasure to see the real hunter, the real guy come out in them. We covered so much ground in such a short period of time. This place is just steep, rugged, dense bush. We were in the trees. We were on our knees, crawling through the brush to find these pigs. They were everywhere. I pushed myself to the limits. My knees are bloody right now, and every time I thought I was gonna leave him in the dust, I turned around and he was right there, and he wasn't even as breathing as hard as me. The guy's in shape and uh, he's on a whole nother level. Ha, 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 ha.
That's a good shot. Damn. They don't go far. Come on, man, give me some. We've been covering these hills for three days now, going after Big Boy, which I had a great opportunity and got actually got worked up and uh, just shot over him. It was great adrenaline high. That's what we come out. That's why we do what we do. We saw pigs every morning, every night. Those ramps that you were talking about. Let me tell you something. You want to sharpen your skills for for archery hunting, uh, mule deer, blacktail. Get out here and hunt these ramps because they are tough. These boars are everywhere. Mike does a real good job of managing the property. Really appreciate it, Mike. It was nice having you up here. We had a good time. It was a good morning. Good end to a morning. Good end to a morning. I'm stoked.